When Diana Gabaldon first started writing the Outlander series, it was for practice and it was all about her wants. Now millions of fans have their opinions and thoughts, but she doesn't care what you think. And I wholly respect that. During an interview with the Sunday Post, Diana Gabaldon said something that made me sit back. It was about expectations and opinions about her Outlander novels, especially the ninth one that will be released later this year. She mentioned show she doesn't care what people think, and I immediately understood and respected that thought. When first starting the series, it was all for practice, more as a way to prove to herself that she could do it. She didn't have the intention of turning it into the ten novel saga that she's planning, nor did she plan the side stories that have come along the way. She certainly wouldn't have thought that it could have been turned into a TV series, which has fifth and sixth seasons confirmed. Back when she started, there were no expectations. People didn't weigh in with how they hoped the storyline would go or share their thoughts on what they thought about individual characters. Sure, we all have our favorite storylines and characters. There will be something that speaks volumes to us and then other elements that say nothing at all, but will speak volumes to other people. Yet, at the end of the day, the writing has to be something an author enjoys. If Diana Gabaldon doesn't feel the story, she's not going to be able to write it. She's always shared that she doesn't write in a linear fashion. She'll write the snippets that her characters tell her to write and then she'll combine them at a later stage. If she was to listen to everyone's opinions, they could influence the story. Or they could force the characters into a corner that they don't want to be forced into. And I write that as a budding author, my fiction novels are written in a similar way and while I know roughly where the characters are going, they're the ones that take me through the story. However, caring about readers' opinions is important. If there aren't the readers then there won't be the book sales. I respect Gabaldon's decision not to worry about that and to focus on the story she wants to tell, even if it means some readers won't like it. After all, there are going to be readers out there who do. It makes me more excited about Outlander Book 9, titled Go Tell the Bees That I Am Gone. This is going to be something that means a lot to her because it's written for her, just like her other novels. No influences from outside sources to worry about. What do you think about the Outlander novels? What do you hope to see in Book 9? Share your thoughts in the comments below.